Welcome back to Academic Avengers. Today, we're diving deep into a topic that's electrifying the world, how China has come to dominate the global solar panel industry. China's supremacy in the solar panel market is unparalleled. From cost advantages to technological prowess, let's explore the key factors that have positioned China at the forefront of this critical industry. At Eco Green Energy's factory in Nantong, Jiangsu Province, production is highly automated, requiring only about 30 workers, scaling up to 45 during peak seasons. The factory boasts a 2 gigawatts annual capacity, relying on advanced domestic machinery. According to the International Energy Agency, IA, China supplied three-quarters of the world's solar panel capacity in 2021. This dominance continues as Chinese companies, facing trade barriers from Washington, have even moved parts of their production to Southeast Asia. In 2023, China's export of solar modules accounted for 80% of global exports, with a total generation capacity of around 220,000 megawatts. Europe was the largest consumer, followed by Asia and Latin America. China's dominance was on full display at the New Energy Conference in Shanghai, one of the largest trade fairs in the industry. Major players such as Longi, Chint, and Ingli highlighted China's comprehensive control over the supply chain. Almost everything happens in China, and the competition here is fierce. China's advantages span the entire supply chain, from raw materials to production technologies. One critical advantage is in the upstream production of silicon, a key material for solar cells. China's low-cost coal-fired electricity makes silicon refining significantly cheaper, around $75 per megawatt hour, 30% lower than the global average. The production equipment at Eco Green Energy is also locally sourced. AutoWell, a company based in Waxi, supplies cutting-edge machines that are updated every two years, ensuring high efficiency in solar energy output. The speed and efficiency of the supply chain are unmatched. Orders placed in the morning can have materials delivered by the afternoon, a stark contrast to the months-long wait in Europe. Our factory was up and running in just six months, thanks to streamlined administrative processes and excellent infrastructure. Such rapid development is hard to achieve outside China. While labor costs in China are competitive, it's the comprehensive ecosystem, from material costs to advanced technology, that solidifies China's position as the global leader in solar panel manufacturing. According to the IEA, the total cost across the photovoltaic supply chain in China is 10% lower than in India, 20% lower than in the US, and 35% lower than in Europe. China's advancements have made it impractical for other regions to compete. 15 years ago, Europe tried to build this industry, but it's now too late. The gap is simply too wide. This dominance has sparked significant trade tensions. A decade ago, the EU imposed quotas and price floors on Chinese solar panels to protect local industries, but these measures failed to boost European production. We cannot forget how China's unfair trade practices have impacted our solar industry. In the US, the situation is similar. The global price drop in solar panels has stymied local production expansion, with industry groups warning against China's potential monopoly. The intense competition in China drives companies to continually reduce costs, leaving profit margins very thin. China's journey began with a focus on renewable energy in the early 2010s, resulting in the rise and fall of companies like SunTech. Today, Longi holds the title of the world's largest solar panel manufacturer, but even they face challenges in this fiercely competitive market. China's dominance in the solar panel industry is a testament to its strategic investments and comprehensive approach to the supply chain. As the world continues to shift towards renewable energy, China's role remains pivotal. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more in-depth analyses from Academic Avengers. See you next time.